Yo, welcome back guys with yet another new video. In this video I will show you which class mage or warrior is actually better. And how I'm going to show you that is just by looking at the spells. So you've got ice spikes for mage and uh, the aquatic smite for mage. And you've got the ice barrage for warriors and ice crash for warriors. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to this uh, fence. And I'm going to check the ranges from all of the um, spells. So I've put on my uh, just my warrior gear and a mage armor. So I can just use the um, mage spells as well. So, I, so you can see the damage. And so you can also see if it's far enough. So I will just start on the fence. Just like this. And let's see and check all the spells. So this, those, these two spells for warrior can just reach all three targets. And now the mage ones, and this one can as well reach the the uh, three targets and the aquatic smite. Right? It's aquatic, right? Yeah. By the way, the uh, spear strike—that's the warrior physical uh, spell from Insane. It's very bad. And why is that? Because its range is very short and it the count cooldown starts after you use it. See I'm using it and now starts the cooldown. So you can better just use Blade Fall if you still have it and you don't have any warrior spells. Okay, so now let's go further back again with the warrior spells. So let's go one, two. So there is some room between the, the fence and me. And let's use it. Ice Barrage still can reach all of them. And Ice Crash as well. Now let's go to the Mage spells again. And of course Aquatic Smite can reach it. And the, what is it called again? Ice Spikes also can reach them all. So and now I'll just back off again. One, two. And we'll be using again the Warrior Spells, Ice Crash and Ice Barrage. Let's use Ice Crash. Oh! He didn't reach the middle one. Okay, I'll try to use it again. See? It hit the, the, um, the ones on the side, but it didn't hit the one in the middle. And now let's use Ice Barrage. This one can hit all three still. Okay, so Ice Crash is a little shorter. And uh, now let's go to the Mage spells. Let's see if they have the same um, uh, distance. And Ice Spikes is kinda the same of Ice Crash. And Aquatic Smite, Smite is kinda the same as um, Ice Barrage. So I'm on exactly the same spot as I used Ice Crash, as he couldn't reach the middle target. So now let's use uh, Aquatic Smite. Oh, it can reach all of those three. And this one should be the same as Ice Crash. But can as well still reach all three targets. So now let's back off with two picks again. And of course Ice Crash can't reach them anymore, so I'll just use just Ice Barrage. Can he reach them all? No, not anymore. Maybe we can reach it with one step forward. Yes, so this is the max of Ice Barrage. Okay, so let's see if... Uh, so I actually backed up two, uh, uh, well, ticks and uh, going to the front again. One tick. So I'll just use the uh, mage spells again and aquatic spikes smite can reach it and spikes can reach it so let's now let's back off once more let's check if ice barrage indeed can't reach it from here nope it can't so now let's use the smite again and let's see if the mage spells can reach it oh this ice aquatic spikes what are those aquatic spikes Ice Spikes, my bad, sorry. Ice Spikes can still reach all three targets. And I'll use Aquatic Smite. 
still can reach all three targets. So Ice Crash was gone already like four ticks ago. It couldn't reach the middle target. And one tick forward, Ice Barrage couldn't uh, reach them anymore. I mean, that was the, re uh, the, the, um, the limit. And I backed up one more and still the Ice uh, the sm mage spells can reach it. So now let's go backwards one more. Can they reach all four? Th they wow, so Aquatic Smite can still reach all three. And jeez. Now well, let's back up one more. Still reaches all three targets. Oh, this is this. Jeez, <laughs> this is the um. Absolute limit for ice spikes because it can't reach the last one yet, but aquatic smite still can reach them all. Okay, let's back up once more. And can aquatic smite still reach? Still, I'm almost on this rock. Like, um, ice crash start stopped already, like here, and I'm like a lot further back now. Okay, let's go back. Yeah, it's gonna still reach. Okay, let's go back once more. I'm almost on the freaking rock. And it can still reach them all. What? This is insane. Holy shit. Okay, I'm now gonna stand on against the rock. You see, I'm standing against the rock. Okay, now. Very last time. Can it still reach it? Yes! What? It can still reach. One tick backwards again. Still reaching. One back again. Still reaching. Once back again. Okay, okay. This is the limit. It cannot reach the middle one anymore. Gee, how on earth is this thing going so far? It can literally reach from here. All the way from here to there. Holy. So this is actually the worst one. Ice crash. It can't even reach the sides anymore. And this one can still reach all three. Damn. Okay, now let's find the... I think the range of ice crash was something like this. Oh, wow. It still can't reach the middle one I'm, Well, while I'm standing here. Like, I was standing here with Aquatic Smite. So one more tick forward, still can't reach it, and in quote, it's like the, this range is insane. Still can't, what? Still can't reach it. How on earth? Now I can reach it. So the difference is like from here to there. All the way to here. It's like, how many? It's literally, literally this distance. Man, so basically, um, aquatic, I mean, mage spells are better than warrior ones, way better, especially the smite. Smite has an insane range, and of course, the the armors and stuff is is just staying the same. But of course, it's the mage version, not the warrior version. For those who want to know, this is my set. I do have the Triton Grey Warrior Armor, but it's not better than this one. So this is my gear right now. 16.977 Legendary and Mesm Helmet. Green, luckily I got it yesterday. 1.567 million damage and 25.6666 health. <laughs> and this one I got from somebody. It has less health than my previous armor, but like... 0.05 more power so uh, let me find it um, this was my previous one 22.3 million health 1.51 damage and this is like 1.56 so, yeah I just really don't know which one to use because this one got like um, 0.05 million more health well anyway so, okay, I will just show you one more tip at the second boss if you're late. So, here is the clip. Right, guys, this is the tip. So, if you get behind, like me right now, you go here. 
and of, I have to wait till the third slam has been done. And as you can see, the slams can't reach me. And if you have time, look, if it's, it's, it's going to the right now, and slams will not reach the end there. So you have to wait till the third slam and the boss, of course, so you can get... Oh, jeez, to heal that. So you can get towards the safe zone because the rest will be a um, spot of doing damage. So that's the uh, tip for you guys. So just if you're late, just see, you can just stand back there and do not die. Sup guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope this help, this video helped you by choosing your class for warrior or for mage. And of course, if you have like the uh, warrior, uh, the enhanced inner rage, try to, you can just change it to the mage version. Of course, for the same, uh, well, just from, just literally swap it. Uh, or maybe add a, a, some, some items, I don't know. Just good luck with trading, because I'm not good with trading. And thank you guys again for watching this video. I hope you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one. See ya!